What's up guys, it's Paul again. Um, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get your iPhone screen onto your desktop. Um, I have some other videos where I've done that. Um, but yeah, it's uh, really handy if you were going to make a, um, a video of your iPhone screen for some reason, or if you're doing a help video like I do. Um, it's that easy. Um, so it's through an application called Chicken of the VNC, as you can see it's uh, right down here um, but to get that all you have to do um, is go to Safari and search in Google chicken of the VNC and it's gonna be the first one right there chicken of the VNC it should be sourceforge.net go ahead and click that <coughs> um, next you're gonna click uh, download at the download buttons right there it's gonna connect you to another page right here and it'll say download will start shortly and it'll say three two one seconds and it'll start um, I already have it downloaded so I'm just gonna stop it um, but once you do that mount it um, and uh, double click it and I suggest copying it to your applications folder so it's not just a uh, download it so you don't accidentally delete it it'll be there for good. Um, so once you have that all done, go ahead and open the application. And so this is where it gets a little bit tricky. Um, it's going to ask for host, and that's really all you have to put in there. Um, this is the this is what it's going to show immediately. Um, it might have a different uh, uh, IP address in there than what I have here, but um, that's just for your. Uh, personal IP address or wherever you are whatever Wi-Fi you're using so um, I'm gonna go ahead and connect to show you uh, how to do this alright so there's my screen um, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna click settings right here and then I am in uh, using my my Y uh, internet tethering uh, so what you're gonna do is see this little arrow next to whatever Wi-Fi you're using and it has to be the Wi-Fi you're using nothing else so go ahead and click that and right here is the IP address that you're on so or that that um, Wi-Fi is on so what you're gonna do is this should be on your um, iPhone or iPod touch um, not on your computer so just find that um, it should be right there as soon as you click that little arrow and so once you get the arrow, um, it's going to show you that IP address. Uh, copy that in to where it said host. and s Delete whatever was there and copy that in. And then click connect at the bottom and it will go straight to your device as long as it's still connected to Wi-Fi. Or the same Wi-Fi network at least. Um, and your device will have a thing that'll say it'll uh, say a bunch of something I never really read it and it'll say at the bottom accept or reject and click accept and it will um, show your screen on your computer um, it's that easy it is a little bit laggy because it's not perfect um, but it is better than nothing and you can still get to the point just like I have um, so yeah, it's a really great thing to do. It's a, um, relatively e easy to get, um, and you can't just, uh, you can either force quit this application or you can do command Q, but you have to click X on, you have to exit the window first and then you can exit it just like that. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching, comment, rate, and subscribe, and I uh, hope to see you in some other videos.